is Alan Boyle with MSNBC. Alan? Thank you. I, I realize you're focusing on near-Earth asteroids today, but uh, there's been so much talk about the potential for finding a planet X or some sort of large body uh, through the WISE survey. Can you comment on any, uh, any status on, on that sort of search or, or maybe even reassure people that planet X isn't coming to get them next year? Uh, yes, this is Amy Meinzer. I'm happy to answer this one. There, uh, planet X is not coming to get us. Um, so, but we are looking to see if there are any other bodies in the outer part of the solar system with the WISE data. This is a very natural project for WISE. And so we're still working on it right now. Uh, it's, we've obviously just returned a huge amount of data from the telescope that's going to take us a long time to sort through. Uh, but the initial results are very promising. You may have seen earlier results where we've discovered a new class of very cool type of stars with WISE. Uh, but the search is still on, and uh, we don't think that there's anything that's hazardous in the outer solar system. We think that this is a, just a sort of a, if there is something out there, it would be a large body in a roughly circular orbit. Our next caller, Denise Chow from Space.com. Denise. So when you say the initial results are very promising, yeah, uh, the, the initial results are very promising. Anything else you wanted to say on that point? We've actually been able to confirm the discovery of 100 new uh, uh, objects that are these very cool stars called brown dwarfs. And so uh, that's very similar to what uh, people are interested in looking for. So we've actually found some of these that are relatively close to the Earth, but none of these are closer at this point than the nearest star to our solar system. So it's a good start, though. Thank you.